this problem is on pentagonal lamina this is problem number 23 in your solution book a pentagonal lamina having edges 25 mm is placed on one of its corners on hp such that the perpendicular bisector of the edge passing through the corner on which the lamina rests is inclined at 30 degree to hp and 45 degree to vp draw the top and front views of the lamina here is a pentagonal lamina of 25 mm sides this corner okay it is resting on corner on hp resting on corner on hp the condition given over here is this perpendicular bisector passing through the corner okay what is passing through the corner which is resting on is makes 30 degree with hp 30 degree with, with hp this is 30 degree with hp and 45 degree with vp okay this is the condition resting on corner on hp this perpendicular bisector makes 30 degree with hp and 45 degree with VP this is the condition okay now let's see how to solve this one start with XY line VP and HP since it is resting on corner problem one of the corner should come to the left so we'll start with the vertical edge over here to the right 25 mm use protractor to mark one not eight degree. On either points, twenty five mm long line along that inclination 108 degree here also twenty five mm then take twenty five mm dimension compass draw an arc same as you did in previous problems Now we got five points. Connect it with visible lines. Number. Okay. Name the points A, B, C, D. We draw one perpendicular bisector also. This one is M one. Now project it upward to get the front view. This is A dash, B dash and E dash, C dash and D dash. In second position, second position, it is given that this perpendicular bisector makes 30 degree with VP sorry HP 30 degree with HP so take one convenient point this point uh, name it as A dash draw one 30 degree line transfer these dimensions first a dash b dash a dash b dash then a dash c dash this is b dash and a dash c dash and d dash connect with visible line 
next project it downward to get front view from a dash to a then b dash and e dash then c dash and d dash finally we got five points e b c d and e. connect with visible lines draw the median also so perpendicular bisector also this is m you know in third position since it is given that this perpendicular bisector is inclined at 45 degree to vp that is given here uh, this length is apparent length of the perpendicular bisector this is a true length of the perpendicular bisector here we need to take in third position we need to take the locus method for that first draw one 45 degree line forty-five degree line. Next mark one point anywhere, one convenient point and name it as M1. Name it as M1. Then take M1 A length M1 A and mark it over here. This is point A. This is point A. Next from M1 draw one locus line. horizontal locus then take apparent length of perpendicular bisector that is am in second position am in second position keep it on a and draw an arc to cut the locus this point is m connect am with thin line only thin line now we got point a a and m and we need to find out uh, find out the points b c b e all four points we need to find out for that simple method is from m draw one perpendicular line to the bisector for this bisector okay not for this one true length apparent length for this draw one perpendicular line perpendicular line like this okay. then measure this distance or else you can take compass to transfer that distance from here to here this intersecting point over here from m to here mark this point and here also draw one perpendicular line perpendicular to this mean bisector line am perpendicular to by am now take this dimension md md and mc are same both are same from m mark two points okay draw arc on either side to mark two points yeah Okay, next take this distance this intersecting point and e this and this are both same okay 
from here to E and from here to B both are same take one of the dimension keep it over here and draw an arc this side and this side both the sides draw two arcs okay name these points this is B C D E connect with visible lines Next, project it upward to get the front view, final front view. From A to A dash, this is A dash, then B to B dash, then here E, E to E dash. This is E dash, this is P dash, then C to C dash. This C dash, then D to D dash. Now connect with visible lines from A dash, B dash, C dash, and show the dimensions. show angle yeah, this is 30 degree this is 45 degree and this angle also show this angle measure this and show this angle this will be around 55 degree 